Hi YouTube and welcome back to my Let's Play Minecraft on Mondays. And I apologize for this episode coming up a little bit late today. I had a number of problems with my recordings and everything again. Um, this time it wasn't my voiceovers that were having problems. This time it was my um, actual recording of the footage of my game. So the footage you're looking at right now is actually something I recorded last week. I just didn't get enough footage for a full episode, so I tried to do some more recording over the weekend, and unfortunately the entire episode you can hear the sounds of Minecraft, but you're seeing my desktop file system instead. I have no idea what happened with Fraps, or why it ended up selecting the wrong thing uh, while I was recording and I was so um, into the game that I wasn't paying attention to the files that were recording otherwise I probably would have noticed that they were the wrong files types um, it, it, instead of um, being Minecraft it was uh, desktop manager um, and so that was just you know that's just kind of random and out there but <laughs> Uh, I do want to apologize that I'm, I'm missing some really exciting footage. So here I am uh, making a second attempt at getting some cows for my farm and um, just kind of having them follow me. And this time I'm kind of walking backwards so I know they're behind me. Uh, since the last time I was like epic fail, I, I kind of ran ahead with my wheat and they didn't follow me closely enough and didn't come into my penned area for them. So this time I'm trying to be smart about it and make sure that I, they are definitely behind me before I uh, run away too fast. So while I'm doing this, uh, actually what I had done uh, in, the, uh, in the footage that is going to be missing from this episode, um, in the mm. far distance you can kind of see some hills over the, um, past the water area and there's some snow and things on there. And mm. so my goal was to go there and uh, see if I could find either some sheep or some wolves. So uh, as, mm. you knew, as you know, I've been talking about wanting to tame a wolf so that mm. I can... Uh, go ahead and have a dog with me. Um, oh yeah, here I am um, making a baby cow. <laughs> I like that. I think it's fun. Um, all right. So anyway, so I went over there exploring and found a wolf and was going to tame a wolf when um, there's like a massive cave system over uh, on that uh, island as well. And because of that, uh, there's actually really big open caves, so there's monsters hiding just inside of them, <laughs> even during the day. Even though I was, it was getting kind of close to dusks and stuff, and so that's probably why they were slowly coming out. And I ended up getting snuck upon by a creeper again, and being blown off the side of a hill while I was trying to tame a wolf. And uh, needless to say, I died. And so probably all of my items that I lost when I died the last time at the bottom of the caverns under my house are probably all completely gone, unfortunately. So with that being said, um, I was able to go back the next day, retrieve my items, and tame a wolf. And you will see that wolf fairly soon. Um, in in this episode, but uh, for right now you can see here. I'm actually digging some holes I'm actually planning on going ahead and adding some water. Uh, I can tell that there is some uneven growth with my Wheat here and so despite the torches and the regular rainfall uh, It could definitely use a little bit of help with some more water So I've decided to go ahead and dig a couple of holes here and I need to uh, create a bucket and start going to uh, go ahead and get some water and I have just enough iron to uh, to make a bucket here so there we go and a little bit left over and I might make a couple of um, steel tools as well in fact I think I did and that's part of the missing footage actually so later on you'll see that I have a steel sword and a, a steel axe I believe so there we go. I just kind of got some things going there. Oh yeah, I was trying to cook some uh, some wheat. I was like, can you do anything with that? Probably not. <laughs> I know bread is uh, wheat and I don't know if that's water or maybe an egg or I forget. There's a there's mm -hmm. recipes online and I haven't tried them yet. 
in terms of making something else. And here I'm trying to <laughs> see if I can make another baby cow. If it's been long enough, it hasn't been, and I accidentally hit the poor cow with the wheat. <laughs> Alright, so here's my bucket, and as you can tell, it's still kind of pixelated. Um, I have not yet um, patched this. I finally found out that, um, and this is my bad, that you have to run the MC uh, patcher every time there's an update to Minecraft, and I didn't realize that, and it took, you know, it took someone commenting on my last video to let me know that, so thank you. Um, you know, silly me, I should have realized that. It just, it, I completely forgot that I had to run MC Patcher in the first place to run um, Snacks uh, Pure Beauty Craft, and so it just didn't even dawn on me to think about that because I completely forgot that that even existed. So, anyway, thanks for that. Hopefully I won't forget next time. Alright, but, oh yeah, and here this silly octopus just dies right in front of me. I didn't even hit it or anything. It just kind of swam up and died. <laughs> gave me a little bottle of ink. And uh, as you can tell, my health is going down a bit and I'm hungry. And all I have in my possessions at the moment are some mushrooms mm. and some grains. And so I was like, okay, I'm hungry. I need some steak. And I didn't want to kill my new cows in my pen yet, since I only have two adults and one baby. And I definitely want those two adults to mate again and make a couple more baby cows, so I'm not quite ready to, to start butchering my cows yet. So I figured a wild one will do. And that way I can go make some steak. Who doesn't love a good steak on a rainy day, huh? Oops, I kind of got myself stuck here, and I'm like, oh, I'm just dig myself out. And yes, I know, lousy use of a sword, but... I was hearing lots of monsters, uh, I think they're... Uh, coming from the cave system just below that sandy area there, and uh, I didn't want to end up getting caught with my pants down again, so to speak. Alrighty, so here we go, making some steak. Steak is always a good thing. I'm a big fan of steak, I don't know about you guys, but, you know, I guess if you're not vegan, I can't imagine, a, unless you're from India or vegan, I can't imagine anyone not liking steak, but that's just me, I guess. <laughs> so here, nomming on some nummy steak. Alright, the uh, sun's going down, so i got to hurry up. I still have a bucket of water here I want to dump out. Into my... And I still need a couple of buckets of water since those are double... Um, double holes there, and so I know that the water's kind of it's flowing at the moment, even though it doesn't really flow very far, but it is flowing, so I need to uh, fill that up a little bit more so that it's full. Alright, so with that transition, look, there we go, here's the puppy dog. <laughs> See, I told you, I lost a lot of footage. So, um, basically that, that last footage that you saw me uh, putting the water in, I basically ended the game there and then came back over the weekend and all the footage from the weekend up until this point here is where, because uh, this is where basically I stopped on the weekend, and then after I looked back at the footage, I realized that everything was gone. So when I started up today, this is basically where I left off in the game. And as you can see here, I'm sure if those of you who have been watching this regularly would recognize this particular cavern. Um, I've just gotten to this cavern uh, in a slightly different direction. Uh, basically digging down from my staircase from my house and f uh, actually discovering a hole to this cave um, that kind of opens up to the bigger cavern here. And so um, I have not explored this part yet. I mean, obviously I've, I've, I did a little bit before um, this particular uh, footage was shot, and thankfully this footage actually came out fine. Um, and here I found some iron, and then I realized this, what I thought was iron, because the light was low, uh, is actually gold, and it, the stone axe wasn't doing anything to it. And I need to come back once I've had a chance to smelt the iron that I've been collecting. And you can see I have 15 blocks of it already. And then I put light up, and I'm like, oh, yes, that's gold. Never mind. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get a little bit more of that iron there. There we go. Got up to 17 now. 
So uh, part of one of the things I'm definitely planning on doing is uh, building some steel doors. Uh, part of the footage that was also uh, lost was the fact that I had a zombie trying to break into my house and he practically broke the door down. Thankfully I managed to hide in the stairwell uh, down uh, that goes down towards the caverns and once I was inside there he stopped trying to break the door down. As Anytime I was inside the house itself he was trying to break the door down but as soon as I went down into that area um, he stopped and so thankfully I still have my uh, complete set of wood doors. But that was kind of scary, actually. I don't know why that scares me. I mean, this is just a computer game, but I was actually pretty anxious when that was happening. I'm like, ah! So, uh, definitely adding some steel outer doors, and then eventually, if I get enough iron again, uh, and I'm going to make more routine um, trips back up to the house to store things and to... Uh, smelt and do other things like that so that I if I do die again I don't end up losing all my stuff I need to make sure that I have a, a good supply of things so that when uh, when that happens I'm not like completely up a crick uh, that was a big mistake of mine before and I don't want that to happen again all right, so here I put a torch down and I realized there is a skeleton in the back. And I'm like, okay, must be daylight outside. Let's go back upstairs. Uh, I don't really have any armor just yet and don't really want to risk either my life or my dog's life uh, dealing with the monsters just yet. So with that being said, here we are going back up to the house. And you can see how far I've dug down here and I actually dug... Uh, into a different direction, uh, and I now have like a um, a fork in my uh, in my tunneling here, and that's how I found that cavern with all the iron. And there's a whole bunch more down there, so um, you'll see me come back here and get more iron at some point in the future, because uh, definitely need it. So here we go. Make sure the dog comes with. So I'm very grateful that my uh, <laughs> that my doors are still intact. Because let me tell you, that really was kind of scary. I <laughs> oh yes, I also built um, a second storage unit there so that I have more storage space. Because I was kind of running out of storage space. Yeah, here we go. Come here, doggy. <laughs> They're kind of cute. I like them. So here I'm checking up on my uh, cows there, and you can see with the addition of the water that uh, my wheat is growing much more uniformly now. I didn't fill in these um, these two holes back here, even though I was originally planning to, but at this point I was like, no, you know, right now I'm not going to, so I'm going to go ahead and just fill them back up with dirt for the time being. And in the meantime, I'm just going to harvest and plant some new wheat. I might start learning how to bake bread at some point so that I can have some more food in the house. Make sure she has a balanced diet. <laughs> Not that it's necessarily necessary, but, you know, bring a little realism to the game. Fill that hole in and get some rest of the wheat. And I do hope I, you know, I'm going to have to pay much closer attention when I'm recording in the future so that I don't have that problem happen again, because that's kind of embarrassing and to be perfectly honest I was really proud of the footage I shot I was like oh this is gonna be a great episode there's all this drama I have this monster trying to break into my house you know I die again and lose my stuff and I go back and get it and I have to deal with more monsters and I, I defeated several monsters without dying um, and I tamed my wolf and you know I thought it was like oh this is all this great footage and I have none of it. So I feel really bad about that. And, um, you know, in in the next couple of episodes, uh, I'm definitely going to go out adventuring again because, okay, so I have my wolf now, but I still need a sheep uh, or several sheep because I need wool so that I can 
make a bed. I keep wanting to make a bed and then I would like to eventually build um, another outpost, another house somewhere uh, as I travel around the world and things. So that concludes this episode. Thanks for watching and until next Monday, take care. Bye-bye.